Hello, this is a short instructional video for instructors at Eastfield College. This will show them how to upload their syllabus onto your, their um, department organization on eCampus and how to create columns and move those columns on Gradebook. Um, first of all, you have to log in to eCampus.dccd.edu. You click where it says access full 23 courses, hopefully for the Spring will say access spring 2014 courses and then I take you to this page you use your ID number um, E and then your ID number and your password click on login and then take you to this page um, to upload your syllabus let's do that first you click on community you will click on the EFC dot dash ARTL dash instructors that's for arts language and literature at Eastfield College then on the left hand side you see some tabs um, the most important one for this purpose we're gonna go straight to syllabi submission then you click on the term which in this case will be spring 2014 scroll all the way down and you see where it says start new submission and you browse your computer you choose your syllabi, your file you want to upload, and you submit. It's really simple. Um, there are directions right on top in case you forget, but if you're a visual person, this is um, good. Once that is submitted, then it's up to your department to link it to the online schedule. Next, I'm going to show you how to create columns on your course shell for the Gray Center. I'm gonna go ahead and pick one of these templates. All right, there's two ways to create a column on the Gray Center. One is by creating an assignment or a test or you know, using the assessment um, options and the tool options on the um, content area. So we're gonna go ahead and just uh, create an assignment just call it that and blah 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 directions for the assignment it's going to be 20 points and um, one single attempt it's due tomorrow night and submit this will create a column under grace center um, and it also it creates an assignment where the students will then turn in the assignment. So now we go to the Grace Center and you can see it here. Here's the assignment. The other way it's by clicking on create columns. Now these assignment columns are usually for assignments that are not um, created or um, have anything to do with the campus. It's something that the student will turn in directly to, to the professor. Um, this one we're going to call it special project um, on this you choose a category I'm going to make this a test and it's worth 100 points and it's due on the 13th so submit and let's scroll sideways and here it is now, um, if for whatever reason you want to move columns, you want to just move them around, you can go under Manage, Column Organization, and you will, you can just move them however you want them, um, in whichever order you want them, and then submit. Or you can use the Sort Columns by. Um, I like doing it by due date, so it'll keep in order and when they're due and that's in that order, that's how the students will see under their grade. And this concludes my tutorial. Thank you.